You know his writing from SNL, his fantastic show Los Espookies, and his HBO special My Favorite Shapes. Please welcome Julio Torres. Hi. Hi. Oh my God, how are you doing? Thank you for doing the show. Thank you for having me. Julio, so in Esquire magazine, you once said, I'm not oh, no. here representing immigrants. I am not here representing Salvadorians or Hispanics or gay people. I have never wanted to use any of those things as a calling card. Who do you want to represent less, immigrants or gay people? Um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe we allow the groups to vote. What do you think your strongest voting block is? I don't know where my numbers are. Either is offensive. Yes, I am very vulnerable that you can fully ADR whatever you want. My name is Julio Torres and I hate marginalized communities. Wow, Julio, that was definitely something. What is wrong with representing immigrants? Oh, um, I don't think there's anything wrong with representing immigrants. I think that I, I'm just like, uh, don't want to speak for people who haven't elected me to speak on their behalf. Mm. Okay, so we looked on your Twitter and we found no results under Black Lives Matter. What the fuck is wrong with you? And do you hate black people? Um. Um. My name is Julio Torres and I didn't post a black square on Instagram either because I don't give a shit about black lives. Wow. What's something about American culture that you hate? It feels like a lot of paperwork, to be honest. It feels like every moment in my life in the US is a day that goes by where I forgot to fill out some form and wow. the clock is ticking. And the repercussions of me not getting back to that person are just getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Mm. And just like getting sick here is yeah. so difficult. It sounds like you hate America. No. What do you love about America? I think that for all its awful, awful, horrible faults, wow. it is one of the few places where like, we both can have a career. In a different world, I think I would be a wife and a mother. I'm always, I think that's my exit plan. Like if this, if this fails, I'm like, I guess I have to get married. Really? Yeah. I would channel all of my aggression into my child. I'd raise the next president of the United States, but they would grow to hate me. May I make a suggestion? Please. I think you would be an incredible stepmother. That's what I've always said. Oh I my think, gosh. I think I am reading stepmother. Oh my gosh. More, God, more than I'm reading mother, mother. Okay, wow. But you don't have to be a mom. Even if you have kids, you don't have to be a mother. That's cool too. That's what I like about America. Wouldn't it be incredible if Seaway was the show in which some viewer somewhere learned that they don't have to be a mother? And what, how would they react? Okay, you're the viewer. Mm. Hey, hey, viewer out there, you do not have to be a mom. What advice would you give my Nigerian parents? How old were they when they came? No, I mean, just like today. What do they need advice in? Being African, living in the United States, having a daughter that's both gorgeous and emotionally unavailable. Keep doing what you've been doing with Seaway, because look at her now, she has a show. That's really, really weird that you'd talk to my parents like that. No respect. I'm sorry. Okay, time to play Wheel, Wheel of, of Access. Access. Do, 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 do. Julio Torres, in this game, you will spin the Wheel of Accents and honor the accent with an impression of it. I flipped a coin before and I decided that I will be spinning and you will be playing. Nigerian accent. You said you're Nigerian? I'm Nigerian. Julio? Um, I mean, uh, uh. Hi, I'm Siwe. Welcome, welcome to my show. You think that's my accent? No. 
Hulu, come on. You're an actor. You're a very talented comedian. I'm a very good get, actor. You're a very good actor. I'm not. You are. No, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. I can barely do my own no, accent. No, you're doing a fantastic Julio Torres impression. Do a Z way impression. My name is Julio Torres, and I refuse to support black women on premium cable. Can I do French? Sure. But since I'm wearing a mask, I wonder if maybe we can get a French actor to ADR my impression. Bonjour, Hubert. Bonjour, bonjour, c'est votre gars. I owe a lot to the French because that's how I met Mary Kate Olsen. Can you elaborate? I was in Paris and I met Mary Kate Olsen. Wow. Can you do an Olsen twin accent? You got it, dude. Wow. I mean, it, it's like the postures. Okay, let's continue. I, try this one. No. You can't try Jamaican. Don't do a Jamaican accent, do a Chet Hanks accent. Uh, Tom Hanks' son. Yeah, Chet Hayes. Because he talks like, he'll be like, uh, Bondi replay. He'll be like, Dirty Wine. Woke up this morning, internet gone mad. Big up the whole island, massive, it's your boy Chetana. Um, but it's, and it's not bad because it's you're impersonating a white guy. You know, it's a shame that you couldn't hear me because I did a perfect Ugandan accent. Oh, well then you could, you won't hesitate to repeat it. I forgot it. You forgot it? Yeah. Okay. Indian, Japanese, anything? I think we covered all of them. Wow. Yeah, I would argue that you contributed nothing and this was... I'll Venmo you for the wheel. Can you do my theme song? Wheel of Access. So that game stunk. But we have a new game. It's called My Favorite Shapes Immigration Edition. We're going to show you a bunch of shapes and you're going to tell me which ones are immigrants. What's their vibe? Where are they from? What's their story? But spoiler, one of these characters is a xenophobe from America. And you'll have to suss that out. This is the xenophobe. Now why? You see an unwillingness to change wow. there. And it is so used to being relied on that the idea of others coming and potentially changing that seems to unnerve this, this object. Wow. Yeah. But which one do you like? I like the shiv. Uh-huh. You know, this one, I, it's just sort of tired of people assuming it has an aggression issue. Mm. When really, it's like, look, I am wrapping myself in duct tape to make myself more palatable. Exactly. That's for you. Thank you. As a Pisces, uh, Scorpio rising, I think that this is me. I want a Korea Scorpio rising. Wait, shut up. What's your moon? Capricorn. That makes so much sense. What's your moon? Leo. My Aquarian self is very evident. I find Aquarians to be very chaotic. Really? And that's okay. I'm not saying yeah. chaos is oh, bad. Chaotic yes. positivity. I'm chaotic. Race war. Whose team are you on? <laughs> Weeds. <laughs> Nancy, <laughs> Nancy Botwin. Who? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, Aquarians. Oprah. I love Oprah, Aquarian. but it's like, hey, look under your chair. There's a free car. That is chaotic. It's chaos. Yes, it is chaotic. I have one last question for you. Mm -hmm. What do you qualitatively mm -hmm. like about immigrants? It often requires resilience. So that is good, period. Yeah, I mean, no, I love that immigrants are resilient, like Christopher Columbus, the way he was resilient right, in right. killing an onslaught yes. of people. Well, thank you for having me. Thanks for doing the show. That's it. My name is Julio Torres, and Christopher Columbus is my homeboy.